In an Australian first, WA Emergency Services are training pet dogs to become search and rescue canines. The poochers are being taught to find people buried under rubble. The course has been so successful it's attracting interest from all over the world. These dogs started out as your average pet. But one day they could save a life. Here at the Fire and Emergency Services Academy in Forestfield, Zena and Banjo are training to be search and rescue dogs, taught how to find people buried in rubble or trapped under debris. You want the dog to listen to you, obey you and do everything you want, and then you're asking it to work away from you independently. These canines could be called upon during an earthquake, cyclone or building collapse. You just never know uh, when you're going to need an ability, a resource such as a, a dog that can find a human being uh, in a pile of rubble. WA's course is the first in Australia. We've got interest from other states and including from New Zealand to come over here. The handlers are volunteers and the dogs their own. Mike Rook says the best candidates are the ones that may annoy you at home. A dog at home that rips all your recheck up, tears everything. A dog that wants to be active, has got drive and is bored. Qualities the emergency services minister discovered first hand. Alright, it's okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Josh Yerger, Nine News.